We are learning new details of a hit and run that killed an eight year old boy in Chesapeake. The man who police say is responsible for the little boy's death appeared in court today. Our News 3 reporter Kelsey Jones was in the courtroom and shares the latest. 38 year old Richard William Humphrey, who police say is responsible for killing the eight year old, appeared in court virtually today as he faced the judge for the first time since his arrest. And this growing memorial that you see here on Battlefield Boulevard that reads in loving memory of Forrest Hooper marks the spot where it all happened. Richard Humpert of Virginia Beach is charged with felony hit and run in the death of eight year old Forrest Hooper. Court documents show on Tuesday Humpert was driving a white 2019 Honda Civic in the 1700th block of Battlefield Boulevard south in Chesapeake. That's when police believe the driver hit the child with his car. Documents say Humpert did not stop, but did later pull over to check his car for damage. Court documents also say Humpert never went back to the scene or called 911 to report the incident. Families in the community continue to leave balloons and flowers to honor the little boy. After police spent days trying to find the person responsible for his death, the owner of Hickory Towing says his surveillance cameras caught everything on camera. We immediately looked at the surveillance cameras. Within a matter of minutes, we were able to identify a car that we believed was a suspect car. We did have a year make and model of the vehicle and a good picture of the car with the damage on it. Matt Salento helped lead an effort to raise nearly $60,000 in reward money to help find the person responsible for Forrest Hooper's death. Now that an arrest has been made, he says that money will go towards the boy's family. Now, if Humpert is convicted, he could face up to 10 years in prison, and his bond hearing is scheduled for Tuesday. For now, in Chesapeake, I'm Kelsey Jones, News 3.